All right, all right, we are live. And hey guys, this is Chris and Sean with Talking Through the Medias. And we are about to go through the brand new, just dropped within the last hour, Suicide Squad trailer number two. Now, I, I don't want to watch too much of a movie that I really, really want to see as far as trailers. I usually do the, the trailer number one. I usually do the trailer number two. And if I'm still intrigued, then I stop. I don't go to three and four and five and all the, I try to avoid all the extra stuff. <clears throat> So I'm, I'm I'm hoping this trailer is really good. What about you, Sean? How do you are are you a spoilers guy? Do you care how many? Trailers I don't want to see spoilers, but I I tend to watch every single damn trailer that comes out because I'm impatient as shit. Yeah. Oh yeah. As yes, much as I can. <laughs> if I say I'm gonna call you in five minutes, and then I'm like, I swear, if I'm not at at five minutes one second, if I'm not on, Sean is fucking putting an all points bulletin on my ass. <laughs> <laughs> he, is, he is calling all fucking cars. Uh, punctual, man. punctual. Yeah, uh, annoying is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> but it's all good. He keeps me honest. He keeps me on task. He keeps me on track. And he keeps it tight. That's what I like about you. <laughs> <laughs> so we're about to do the Suicide Squad 2 Electric Boogaloo. Let's and do it. All right, give us a countdown. All right, in five, four, three, two, one, go. Damn it. I'm having, there we go. <laughs> Gentlemen, ladies, what if Superman had decided to fly down, rip off the roof of the White House, grab the president right out of the Oval Office? Who would have stopped him? Nobody. <laughs> Not a fucking soul. Batman. It would have been Batman. It would have been Batman. <laughs> Will Smith. I want to build a team of some very bad people who I think can do some good. Y'all jokers must be crazy. <laughs> Damn, look at her, man. <laughs> the deal you disobey me you die try to escape you die you got a boyfriend you irritate or vex me you irritate or vex me to be quite vexing <laughs> you I'm die sure you. you die you don't own me. If they get caught we throw them under the bus you don't own me what a ride yeah let's play come on got some better attempt This guy. The ball room mix. Ball room mix. Uh -oh. Not good. Don't forget, we're the bad guys. Are you sweet talking me? All of that chit chat's gonna get you hurt. The the oh, there's Batman. Yeah, I want to see something. Yes, I want to see something. I was just trying to get you there. You know how it feels, right? We're good. <laughs> what you having? Beer. Whiskey. What am I, 12? How about you, hot stuff? Water. That's a good idea, honey. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, I like, I certainly like the tone that they're, they've got yeah. going this thing. I heard that um, that after the reaction to um, let me line it up again. Let me get me let me get me back in focus here. The Batman <laughs> Superman reaction. Yeah, I heard that Disney uh, not Disney. I heard that Thanks. Warner Brothers is freaking Thanks. out and they Thanks. they want to make it. They want to crank up the comedy again because the fun. Yeah, exactly. So when they when they started off and they said we got we have a whole lineup of um, a new DC, uh, DC cinematic universe starting off and it's going to be serious and darker toned. We're going to try to do we're not going to do what Marvel's doing because you see that on their end where we're going to be there where they're more fun. We're going to be more serious. 
and then they tried it with Batman versus Superman. And now the people were like kind of mixed about it. Now they're freaking out. Like now it's like, oh no, now we're gonna be fun. We're gonna be fun now. So I feel like I don't know. I feel like Suicide Squad would have been fun no matter what. Cause you got Harley Quinn in there. And um I, I still say they, they should stick to the serious tone. I just feel like um they're being too uh, reactionary. And uh, they should just stick to their formula because if, if the fans who love Marvel and want to see more Marvel stuff, if they make DC force their hand and try to make them more like Marvel, it's just going to then then when they, if the, and then if DC does it, then the fans are going to uh, uh, bite them and, and uh, turn on them and be like, well, now you're, you're too much like Marvel. You, you're never going to please them. So, I don't know. That's my instant reaction. I love this trailer, though. But what do you think? I agree. I thought the trailer was really good. I think this is probably my favorite Suicide Squad trailer that's come out. Um, I don't really want them to be just like the Marvel movies. I want them to have their own kind of deal. And hey, man, I like the serious side of the DC. And everybody, you know, we we've had this argument where we're like with the DC movie, DC don't make good movies. Bullshit. The Dark Knight's DC, Batman, the you know, Dark Knight Rises, those are badass movies. Mm. You name, you tell me a comic book movie that's better than the Dark Knight. Avengers, it's arguable. It's, it's I, well, very, in my opinion, it's very in my, opinion, <laughs> in my opinion, I I enjoyed the Dark Knight more than I I did the Avengers. Not to take uh, away the, the only the only reason why I give the Avengers the, the edge is because it's a one hundred percent comic book movie. You cannot mistake that. The Dark Knight, you can take Batman out of there, and that's a freaking awesome drama. To me, that was a very good drama. They, they, I think Nolan did a great job at taking a comic book character and making a a, a cop drama out of it. That was that, that's why the Dark Knight to me is so awesome. So, I, I was just so amped up to go see the Dark Knight, way more amped up than I was to go see the Avengers. But that was just my opinion. Yeah. So guys, um, that's Suicide the Suicide Squad trailer. We'll we'll keep you updated on this. Yeah, the um, I, I like. I'm gonna give a thumbs up to this trailer. I liked uh, every. I liked it. Everything. Let me switch cameras. Everything that I saw on uh, on uh, this trailer, Marco Robbie is obvious. It's, it, it seems like Margot Robbie and Will Smith are coming out as the stars of this movie. And uh, <laughs> I'm gonna call this a Suicide Squad documentary, man. This is more than a movie. This is gonna be an event film. So I can't wait to see it. I'm I'm on board. They they've hooked me on this. I'm not watching any more. I'm gonna try my best to avoid any more footage. This did it for me. You got my ticket. I'm coming. I mean, I'm going to the movie. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, All right, guys. So in the meantime, we are getting ever closer to giving away Captain America Cap tickets. Captain America tickets. <laughs> and then I guess the next one would be Suicide Squad tickets. Oh. There you go. Let me let me let me fix it on there. There you go. Now it's on you. So yeah, we're we're all. How close are we now? We got uh, about eighty six subscribers now. Yeah, yeah. I think we're we're almost there. Once we get a hundred, we're giving away Captain America tickets. Uh, so in the meantime, guys, uh, click subscribe. Please tell your friends. Check us out. Um, keep playing the games, watch the movies, and killing the noobs. And I can't wait to see Margot Robbie try on those panties. Yeah. Peace. <laughs>